Classic service and style. We started this AGM today with uh, the celebration, the best prayer, the highest prayer, the celebration of Holy Mass. It uh, was a beautiful Mass. It's got celebrated by three priests for the veteran uh, chaplain and uh, for the Elvis Gante and uh, the uh, presided over by uh, the Linus. It was, it was just the best way to start the uh, AGM. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate this week. And immediately after that, we went to uh, the uh, actual AGM. I would say this is like the most successful we've been in through an AGM. We went in there with three clear objectives, clear tasks that you could accomplish, and we accomplished them in record time. The one, the most important one, was to re establish Cerveza's bylaws in the way that the, uh, the association would like for the teacher. Then finally, uh, we went ahead and talked about the celebration of the. Uh, 60th anniversary of St. Vincent's College, which is next year. It was founded in 1963. So uh, next year makes it uh, exactly 60 years. So we're grateful that the bishop did give us some guidance on what we should think and how we should expect the event to go on. And uh, the uh, General Assembly is very, very grateful for that guidance and took it to heart and we are moving forward. And there is something we did today which is really unique. This is amazing, this is new. Uh, we thought about how to engage different cohorts of our community. And most importantly, it was a senior cohort. So we devised something called the Council of Elders. And today was the maiden dinner with the Council of Elders. We just wrapped that up. It's, it was wonderful. The thing is, uh, elders have to create a space for elders where they go in gently discuss how to help the community, the service community. The Council of Elders to me is a very brilliant and welcome initiative. It for once brought the limelight of that old age is not a curse, and that it can be a blessing. And uh, the problem was is like the concept is the elder people should pass over to the young people what they know. And I think that if other people come from more elderly people belong. And when the more elderly people belong, the more the elder people belong, it is hope that the younger people will now follow the example for the elderly people and the future of any nation that has the elders as leaders can only be solid. Tonight we're we'll gonna wrap it up with uh... A fabulous gala, so high expectations for the gala, a classic service so of Sabesa passion. We will meet those expectations and it will be a great time. And uh, again, if you don't have the chance to do it this year, uh, join us next year during the uh, celebration of the 60th anniversary. <laughs>